So the second thing that we need to do along with the artwork files is to generate the drill file or the NC drill file which basically defines where all the holes would be drilled by the machine that manufactures your PCB. So to do that what we do is we go to export in case of ORCAD PCB Lite and in case of Allegro PCB it's under manufacturing itself. But we go to export and then go to NC drill and in here what we would see is the name so that is fine in NC parameters what we need to set are that uh, all of these should be okay leading zero suppression should be checked and enhanced exelon format should be checked as well then uh, in here the auto tool select should be set by default repeat codes is checked we should uncheck that and there should be the optimized drill head travel that is checked so then we hit drill and our drill file should be created once we are done with that, what we can do is we can actually check whether that happened okay or not. And for that, we can use any of the online Gerber viewers available to us. So in here, what I'll do is I'll choose file and I'll import the top, bottom and all those things so that we can see what went on with our file creations. So let's go with bottom art that will be generated. Okay, so that looks fine then uh, I'll do the top art which is here then I will do the outline seems fine as well then I will do one by one the other ones so we have silk screen bottom then we have silk screen top then we have solder mask top and we have solder mask bottom once we are done with the art files we are going to import the drill file which is this one right here so I'm going to open that and that is it now whether the drill file gave something to the design or not we can see by unchecking all these others over here and uh, let's see in here now if we zoom into this diagram over here we can see that the drills are being shown so if I turn the drills off those go away but if I turn it on the drills come back in so let us do away with the other outlines as well and now we can just see the drill files so the drill file has come out properly and we are okay so what we need to do then is we need to collect these files so they are in this folder of mine so I'll collect the bottom art I'll collect outline I'll collect silk screen bottom and top solder mask bottom and top and top itself and the drill file and these are the ones that go to the manufacturer so I create that manufacturing files and there I do away with the old ones and I paste the new one so this one you zip it up and you send it to the manufacturer and hopefully if everything goes fine then the board would come back to you so that's about the generation of the artwork that you need to send to the manufacturer uh, please proceed on to the next video to see a couple of extra things which you need to do as part of this project.